When my body has disintegrated back into the soil, and all that is left of this black body is my white bones, I hope to forgive this life for happening to me. If earth is my custodial, then death is the only way to be free. But I will remember. Poverty's crooked smile, plastered on the faces of the hopeless, its insecure ways, how it crept into dreams and left them broken, all for the purpose of gaining recognition among the poor. Women with children on their backs, tied so securely with the hope to carry them forever. The boys who gambled their lives away, with every move they played, they remained stagnant. Tarred roads in forgotten cities, black and filled with holes, almost like its people. The clear division line between black and white, a reminder of how our past is still very present. Something in the air during protest, a desire, a need to be heard, and the uncertainty that comes after the march. Suicidal children in broken homes who formed a relationship with death after life cheated on them. School children at bus stops, oblivious about the future and yet tormented by the past. A man's tears, small, tiny droplets that seem to leave stains on their masculinity. Old women with broken smiles, wishing to unsee the cruelty of this world which is evident in their cracked feet and wrinkled eyes. When they tell you stories, which emanate from experiences that cannot be undone. Listen to the sound of agony made beautiful and pray this is not their last chapter. Politics, a chess game that the rich play for fun, where the commoners are their pawns deprived from the chance of becoming queen. The victims are addicted to drugs, as this is the only chance they get to feel high. As much as we all need to feel alive, sometimes surviving is the worst kind of pain.